Welcome to this video. Today, in this video, we will study trigonometric ratios of complementary angles. Let's have a general discussion. Can you tell what is the meaning of complementary angles? Perfect. Any two angles whose sum is equal to 90 degrees are called complementary angles, which we can understand with these examples. Let us now discuss the right angle triangle XOY. We know that the sum of the three angles of a triangle is 180 degrees. In the triangle XOY, angle O is right angle and both the remaining angles X and Y are acute angles. So, can you look at the diagram and guess whether there are any pairs of complementary angles here? Yes, here angle X and angle Y form a pair of complementary angles. That is, we can say that the value of angle X plus angle Y will be 90 degrees. Assuming the measure of angle X in the triangle XOY is theta, so the measure of angle Y would be 90 degrees less theta, which we represent here by phi. So, let's find the trigonometric ratio of theta. You can also revise SOH, CAH, TOA to find the value of trigonometric ratios. Where for sine theta, we can say that its value will be equal to the ratio of the opposite side of theta and hypotenuse. Where the opposite side is OY, and the hypotenuse is xy and if we talk of cos theta then its value will be equal to the ratio of adjacent side and hypotenuse. Here the adjacent side is xo and the hypotenuse is xy. Similarly, find values of other trigonometric ratios which are represented by equation 1. So now, can you find the trigonometric ratios of the angle phi in the triangle XOY? Well done! The value of sine phi will be equal to the ratio of the opposite side of angle phi and hypotenuse, where the opposite side is XO and hypotenuse is XY. But from the figure, we can see that theta and phi form a pair of complementary angles. Hence, let us substitute phi with 90 minus theta. Similarly, find values of other trigonometric ratios which are represented by the two equations. Since we have to find the values of trigonometric ratios of complementary angles, hence, let us compare equations 1 and 2. Thus, we can see that the value of sin 90 degrees minus theta is equal to the value of cos theta. If you notice, you will see that the value of cos 90 degrees minus theta is equal to sin theta. Similarly, tan 90 degrees minus theta is equal to cot theta. Cot 90 degrees minus theta is equal to tan theta. Sec 90 degrees minus theta is equal to cosec theta. And the value of cosec 90 degrees minus theta is equal to the value of sec theta. Where all values of the angle theta lie between 0 degrees to 90 degrees. In this video today, we studied trigonometric ratios of complementary angles. In the next video, we will see interesting examples based on this.